What's up, guys? This is W Drums live from my college dorm room. We're back with another Skylanders Giants redo review. This time I redid Pop Fizz. He is now on the Best of the Beast path. And I will give you guys my two cents on it in just a second. We are on chapter 15, uh, Lost City of Arcus. So here's his stats. I love that hat from the um, old game that you can buy. It's the unicorn hat. It's amazing for when you don't have heroics done on a Skyliner. Amazing. Um, upgrades. Potion lob. Press A on the Wii Remote to lob his currently equipped potion. Beast form. Press B on the Wii Remote to drink a potion and temporarily change into a beastly form. New concoctions. Press Z on the Wii Remote to switch to some new potions, which have different effects when thrown. Puddle of Pain. Press Z on the Wii Remote to slide to an I'm sorry, cycle to a new potion that leaves a damaging puddle of acid when thrown. Raging Beast. All attacks and beast form do additional damage. Dexterous uh, delivery. Throw potions and grab new ones much faster. And as I said, I chose the best of the beast path. We have more beast. Beast form meter drains slowly and recharges much faster. Berserker boost. In beast form, damaging enemies increases the beast form meter. So every time you damage something, it ups the time you have in it. And mutant beast. Pre in beast mode, press Z to perform a special attack based on which potion is active. So either the purple green or yellow, and you'll see a different attack. The yellow is my favorite, which is the flamethrower. And then a soul gem, shake it. Repeat it ah, repeatedly, press Z in the Wii Remote to shake a potion bottle until it explodes. Fa uh, soul gem is found in Wilkin Village. Without further ado, let's get cracking. So, let's go to beast mode. Here's the basic stuff. Now watch how, like, I'll let the timer go a little bit. Now watch. Hit it. It's like, whoa, it just went up. And you just save it. The problem that I'm finding, though, that'll be really hard with PvP for this is the fact of how slow he is in the beast form. I feel like he's not going to be that much of a threat. So you get in beast mode. Hit B. That's his one combo. He launches claws at you, like such. Now we'll switch potions, go to beast mode again, and we will do this. He does this crazy claw attack. My favorite though is the flamethrower, and I'll show you that in a second. I mean, he's good, don't get me wrong, for story mode he's great, but I don't, I don't know if I'd like him for PvP. Then my favorite. Burn them like they're nothing. See ya. Skylanders of the Earth element are stronger in this show. Attention! Tonight there will be a robot musical about me and my awesome rise to power. All minions are ordered to attend. That is all. So I'll show you his uh, beast forms one more time. Sorry, that's my cell phone going off. I'll get it later. I'm filming right now. So we're going to beast mode. Use the flamethrower again, which is my fave. It's very effective. If you haven't noticed. Get the claw attack. Or no, the lunge attack. The purple one I'd say is my least favorite out of all the potion combos. Second favorite would be green. First would be gold. Just claw through them like they're nothing. Come here. 
Just annihilates them. What the heck? Oh. I think they're not freeze on me now. Oh, Mr. Lobber. You can get that. There we go. Oh, yeah. We've, I mean, there's this attack, but this has nothing to do with his beast path, but I've already showed it in my other videos, so sorry, I kind of forgot about that one. Yeah, I was focusing more on the beast path. So that is Pop Fizz in a nutshell. Hope you guys enjoyed. Stay tuned for more. Peace.